Um, I wanted to jump on and check in with you guys because um, I know it's been a while. So I wanted to say hi to everyone. Hi. Hi, Nikki. <laughs> I'm just sitting here listening to some music. Um, I wanted to check in with you guys. Um, it's been a little while and thanks. I just literally like, well, I haven't even washed it, but thanks for liking my hair. Um, I wanted to check in with you because since I last saw you, I got married, um, which has just been so amazing and was such a crazy experience. and. Um, you know, me and Dee have been together for nine years, so it's, a, it's about time. Um, but yeah, just so, so happy. And we had an amazing experience. I got married in Italy, uh, which I just love Italy anyway, but I've just fallen more in love with it. Hey, Dom! <laughs> um, yeah, just fallen more in love with Italy, the country, the people, the food. I feel like a piece of pasta right now. I look like a piece of pasta because that's literally, um, yeah, literally all I've been eating is pasta, pizza, pasta, basically, for the past two months, so, yeah. Um, shout out to Max, hey. Um, yeah, so I'm a piece of pasta, but I'm a happy piece of pasta because I'm a married piece of pasta, so. Um, so yeah, oh hi, Eleonora from Rome, Italy. We actually went to um, uh, Rome as part of our little kind of honeymoon, uh, well, calling it a mini moon, because we did like a little trip after, um, after I got, after we got married, we did a little trip around Italy. We went to Rome and we went to Priano. It was just so beautiful. And then we went to Venice, which was amazing. Um, but yeah, I wanted to check in with you guys um, because also tonight I am going to be on NBC Songland and I wanted to let you guys know because I'm really excited about it. Yay! Um, it was really interesting. It was such a cool experience um, doing the show because obviously I was working with up-and-coming songwriters and just it just reminded me of how I started out and how I you know, was on a show where I was fighting for my dreams and these songwriters were doing the same. So it really gave me a chance to support up and coming songwriters, support up and coming talent. And um, it was fun because doing the show, I didn't necessarily, basically the premise of the show is that you, um, there are songwriters that come and they submit their songs. We take the songs, we work on the songs um, and then the artist um, records the song that they think um that they want to record out of of all of these songwriters um submissions and i got the chance to pick something that's very different for me um that's kind of like different out of um the ordinary of, of what i'd usually do which was really fun because this show gave me the opportunity to just try something new um and not necessarily go for a song that is um a classic kind of song that i would do um, but more of, of like an opportunity to showcase different artists as well as um, showcase a different side of me. So, yeah, it was really, really fun. Um, hi, Michelle. And hers truly. Thank you. It's my feather tattoo. And I got this um, in honour of my grandmother. Um, so every time I look in the mirror, I see it and I think of her. She's like always on my shoulder, which is nice. <laughs> I'm very excited about seeing it. If you guys know, you know that I'm a horror fan, big time. So I'm going to see it next week. I'm so excited, such a horror fan. Um, oh, saw you twice live in Birmingham. Oh, thank you. I love going to Birmingham, you guys are crazy and amazing always just so much love when i perform there i love it ah uh, i'm just reading some of your comments oh thank you guys you're so sweet <laughs> someone's like i hate horror movies 
Sorry. Um, Cause I love them. Uh, yeah, it, this was actually the Songland song was a really good opportunity for me to kind of give you guys something for the summer, like a summer feel while I'm um, working on new music. And of course, as always, just thank you guys so much for always supporting me and for, um, you know, waiting patiently because I want to give you something amazing and special. And every time I put something out um, of, of my own music, it's always something that I've worked really hard on, something that comes from the heart and that I feel is deserving of you guys. So that's why I do take time um, during my creative process and making music and songwriting, I take time to make sure that it's the right thing um, for me and obviously that um, you guys are going to love as well because that which comes from the heart easily reaches the heart. That's a quote that I always have in my mind whenever I'm doing music. It has to come from the heart, it has to come from a very genuine place and it has to be right, um, which is why I've taken my time. But I'm very excited about new projects this year um, uh, and next year. So I'm really hoping that I'm going to be getting some music out to you. Well, I will be getting some music out to you um, end of the year and next year. So I'm really excited about that. And I always appreciate how much you guys support me and send me so much love. And it's just after, you know, you guys have been rolling with me since day one over 10 years ago yes i love the callum scott duet like that was again like something that really came from my heart and that i really put a lot of love and thought into um and yeah it's one of my my favorite duets that i've done so and i love callum my little buddy and also make sure you guys come down to hopefield animal sanctuary in the uk essex whoever's in london or in essex or in the uk in general wherever you are come down to hopefield animal sanctuary in brentford brentwood in essex um it's open i think we're open every day of the week during the summer holidays and then monday um monday to oh uh friday saturday sunday monday um, when it's not summer holidays. So make sure you come down, come down to Hopefield, see all our animals, our amazing rescue animals. Um, we just had a bunch of new little baby bunnies that were born uh, from some of our rescue bunnies. So make sure you go and see them because they're so, 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 so cute. Um, come down and support us because we always need lots of help, uh, volunteers, or just come down and visit. Bring your kids, sisters, friends, nephews, everyone, bring everyone down and come and support the animal sanctuary because the animals need you. Yeah, thank you. Oh, Jonathan, are you opening a store or a business? I am actually in the middle of um, opening a new project that's uh, been a labor of love something that I've been thinking about doing for a good few years and I'm actually building it right now so I don't want to say what it is right now until it's finished but it's going to be finished probably in the next month or so so I'm really excited um it's a, a new business so you know support your local female businesswoman um but yeah something again that I'm really excited about and that I've just been working on on the sidelines um because you know as a woman we can do multiple things and and um, be successful at multiple things as well. So we've got to support each other and empower each other to broaden our horizons and, and to do things that we're passionate about and that we love. I hope to have a concert in Spain at some point. Um, I mean, I'm really, really hopeful that I'm going to get to... I, I want to tour next year. That's like something that I really, really want to do in some capacity. So I'm working towards doing a tour next year. Um, so I hope that you guys will all be there um, when I do. Mm -hmm. Next UK gig? Mm. Soon, very soon. But I love you guys. I love you guys too. Make sure you... Hi from Shanghai. I just love how... 
um, international everyone is on here, like everyone from all over the world. And like I said, I really appreciate you guys. Always appreciate you guys supporting me, listening to my music, checking in with me and what I'm doing. Um, I am working hard to bring you um, new music um, and new projects that I'm really excited about. Um, also, my show that I filmed, The Oath, um, check me out. My character's name is Amber and it's already streaming in the UK, um, already streaming in the US and it started to stream in the UK on My5, so Channel 5, you can stream it on there, which is really exciting because it's a project that I was just so excited to be a part of, very different, it, um, it's like an adrenaline rush, so you have to watch it, you have to check it out, I play a character called Amber and it was really, really just such an interesting experience to play somebody like her and to really get into her character and dig deep into who she is. Um, I don't know if you guys know, but I went to theatre school from a very young age um, and I always really loved acting, but I never thought that um, I would be the kind of person that would be an actor because I thought you had to be some kind of crazy extrovert and but you don't um and i've been taking classes again um for the past five years um so um yeah uh public classes for the f past five years which has been really interesting and a different experience for me um because you know it's so it's although it's kind of you use the same kind of tools as you do in music you're just emoting um, it is very different and um, it's been really great doing class and being dedicated to something like that um, again and, and being a student. I just think it's always important to be a student. Like I, I was on, I actually went, did a live stream a little while ago and I was at a vocal retreat and being a student again, just being a student of music, being a student of voice and we can always keep learning and, and keep adding to our craft. So. The acting has been really, really um, fulfilling for me. And I just really enjoy it. It's something I'm really dedicated to and passionate about. Um, and yeah, something that just, just I, that I love doing and that I'm glad that I get the opportunity to do it and to showcase a little bit of you, it to you. My necklace, Jan said, what does my, ne my necklace says Melrose. Melrose um, was my little rabbit that I had for a very long time, years and years and years, and she passed away a couple of years ago, so... Oh, my phone just went off. Yeah, I got this little necklace made with my bunny's name on it, who passed away. It's in her memory. Um, D. Ebora, Melrose is the one that I rescued. She was just a street rabbit on the street uh, with a guy. Um, a homeless man and I went up to him and I offered to like buy him some food um, and he had a baby rabbit I don't ask me why just sitting on his bag um, so I, I said I'd take her to a shelter then when I took her to the shelter basically they couldn't take her in so I ended up keeping her and I'd never had a rabbit before so I just treated her like a dog and like and she just like ran around the house and she's basically everyone calls her a dog rabbit called her a dog rabbit because she acted like a little dog <laughs> hi from the philippines i love you guys hi brazil hi hi guys <laughs> um oh what's my favorite song that i've written hmm. i wrote a song called thank you with toby gad and i wrote that for my mum and dad um and that's probably one of my favourite songs. Uh, I also wrote a song with Walter A called Here I Am, which is on my first album, Spirit. And that song is probably one of my favourite songs that I've written as well. And Happy, which I wrote with Brian Tedder. One of my favourite songs. So three. <laughs> three favourite songs. Um, yeah. Uh, and I actually got to work again with Brian Tedder on the show, on Songland, um, which was really, really cool. You guys know we're like we go so far back and it was just cool to get to work with him on the show as well and see him shining on the show it was it was really cool hi england 
I mean, I love Nicki. I love Nicki Minaj. So, yeah, definitely. Ciao. Ciao from, uh, to Italy. And Hong Kong. That's so cool. I love just seeing, like, where everyone's tuning in from. It's so cool. So cool. Cambry, Ben. Yes, I love Tori Kelly. Her voice is so beautiful. Um, she's such a good songwriter as well. Great artist. Hey, Leon, I love you. We need more music. I know, it's coming. Music is coming. It just takes a while. Like like I said, I want to give you guys something that, you know, really is so special and so deserving of you. So, again, thank you for always supporting me in my creative process and the time that it takes to make something that is truly meaningful, special, and deserving of you guys as well. So, yeah. Uh, I'm working on it and also I have some other projects that are coming too so you guys will definitely have more more from me this year and next year hi from Indonesia love it how is it to perform with Taylor Swift really fun um, she's such a cool cool girl um woman she's just such a great artist um so lovely so lovely to work with and actually lover is one of my favorite songs of her right now um actually i think it's my favorite taylor swift song is lover uh so, it's so good i've been singing it all week hi from the netherlands hi to the netherlands i just actually played um motivation by namani because that song is sick. <laughs> and that video is epic. Yes, um, I actually worked with Ryan um, and we have been working together on something special. So yeah, any gigs in Germany? Hi to Malaysia. Hopefully again, like I said, I'm hoping, really hoping to tour next year. So fingers crossed, um, my dream and plan is to tour next year and bring you guys some music um but i love you guys so much thank you for checking in with me and again for supporting me i love you guys and i'm gonna check in with you very very soon mwah, 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 mwah.